the, the point the point being that um, these ventures now seem to have a wonderful momentum and things are going well but I I remember well there was a point in time yeah. when when e each of them uh, had their their tipping point and could have gone either way I wonder I wonder if you could talk a little bit about the origins of Tesla sure um, so with the uh, um, I, I, as mentioned, I was quite interested in electric cars from when I was doing my undergrad physics. And um, in fact, I originally came out to California to do a PhD at Stanford in applied physics and material science to work on ultra capacitors and electric cars. Um, so it was a, a long standing interest of mine. And, um, and the internet kind of put that on hold for a few, few years. But then once, after PayPal, I decided I wanted to get back into um, electric vehicles. and. Um, make something happen in that arena, particularly since um, GM had, had come out with the EV1, and, and I thought, okay, well, there's not really a need for a startup company to develop electric cars, because obviously GM is going to create the EV2 and the EV3, this logical sequence, and um, it will get increasingly you know, get, get better and better with each iteration, um, and so not really a need for, for, for a new company in that arena. Um, but, but actually what happened was that after California changed the regulations to no longer require electric cars, uh, GM recalled all the EV1s, and then just to make sure that nobody could get them back, they crushed them in a, in a, in a lot somewhere. Um, and, and in fact, um, while they were being crushed, the, the people who had been the EV1 owners who did not want those cars recalled actually held a candle at vigil as though somebody was getting oh. executed, basically. Um, and it's like, that just seemed extremely crazy that GM would ignore this because um, you know, it's quite rare for people to hold a candle at vigil about a product. Um, <laughs> and particularly a GM product. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah. so if, if, if people are doing that, you should really pay attention. Um, but but they, they, they wanted to just sort of erase all that. And uh, so I thought, okay, well, we've got to try to create an electric car company. But it, it wasn't as though in creating these companies that we thought that we would be successful. Um, I thought that the most likely outcome was failure, um, but, but it was still worth doing.